Oh, like, hello everyone. Today in this video, I just gonna teach you how to evolve the Digimon inside the Vital Bestlet. Yes, yes. Oh, like, now let's see this Digi Evolution chart. Where well, you can see all here the Digi Evolution timer. This timer means uh, how long it takes to the Digimon to evolve yes yes like the in training one it take one hour to evolve to the in training two the in training two take three hours to evolve to rookie and rookie Digimon take 16 hours to digivolve to champion Digimon Mm, for for the champion and the ultimate is the same both take 24 hours to digivolve but sometimes uh, the digimon does not e does not evolve even the the, the digim the digivolution timer already round round out why of, why of that that because probably you had the Digimon does not met the requirement to Digivolve. So what the the requirement to Digivolve? Okay, there's a four requirement to evolve the Digimon. Okay, one of them are the vital value. You can see the vital value on your home screen here. Okay, now let's talk how you want to increase this vital value. The only way to increase the vital value is by wearing the vital bracelet. It will increase each 5 minutes when it detects your heartbeat. Second, it will increase each, uh, each amount of step. If I remember, 50, 50 step will increase 5, 5 point. Yes, yes. And the last one, the way to increase the vital value is to battle. By winning the battle. But be careful, you can lose your vital value if you lose the battle. Yes, yes. Okay, the next requirement is the battle. Yes, yes, the battle. The, it will count the number of battles you have done and also the win rate. How many times you win. Hmm, the Digimon will evolve depending how much you battle and how percentage your win rate. Okay, let's talk about how you want to battle. Okay, to battle using this vital bracelet, you need to go to the to the NFC point, such as vending machine or Nintendo Switch uh, Ami Amiibo scanner. Yes, yes. The Nintendo product, the Amiibo scanner, is also NFC. Just open your your vital bracelet uh, on your home, and then go. To Go touchy, touch the bracelet to the NFC point. Yes, yes. And then the battle will begin. That's how you want to battle. And the last condition to evolve your Digimon is the trophy. Yes, the trophy. Okay, how you want to get this trophy? This trophy can get by doing mission. Alright, the mission have like four category inside the fighter bracelet: the normal mission, the hard mission, the special mission, and the adventure mission. Hammer, hammer. Okay, the normal mission you will get one each day. This, uh, it will be random between this. Four mission 
Mama Hammer. You only can get one each day with this normal mission. If you are able to complete it, you will get one trophy. Yatta. Okay, let's talk about the hard mission. The hard mission is this exercise time. Alright, there's a four mission each day you can do in the hard mission. Yes, yes. So basically, every day you're gonna do exercise. Good, good. And also, don't don't cheat doing this exercise. I mean, you can use the vital bracelet and just shaking it. No, you can do that, but. Uh, will it benefit you and will you have fun doing that? <laughs> okay, so the hard mission, if you do great, you will get two trophies for each mission. Nice! But if you only good, you if you only able to do average, you only get one trophy. And also, if you if you do really bad, you got zero trophy. Yeah, bye. <laughs> zero, no? <laughs> zero. <laughs> so be careful. Do your exercise properly, please. And play your play the toy correctly. Okay. The, the third mission is the special mission. The special mission, uh, you need to con connect the the vital bracelet to the app, the the app in the smartphone to get the sm the special mission. Is it more harder than the normal mission? It have the like a normal mission, but it's more harder. If you are able to complete it. You will get three trophy. Nice three. That's a lot. And the last one is the adventure mission. Even though the name is mission, this one you cannot get any trophy here. You cannot get trophy. But if you able to complete all the adventure mission, you will unlock the Hidden Evolution Yes Hidden Evolution Let's go hey, But wait There's another way to evolve The Joggers Evolution Yes The Joggers Evolution What the difference between Joggers Evolution and Normal Evolution? Here's the thing Joggers Evolution uh, It's like you will skip the the condition, the requirement. You do not need to use the requirement to evolve. You just evolve. Be like wow, so good. Okay, how how this joggers evolution work? Okay, in the vital bracelet, you can keep two Digimon in one bracelet. One will be the active one and the one you can see in your home screen Another one you keep in the backup Yes, yes Okay, how to trigger the jokers? Okay, let, let I just show the chat here Here the, the, the chat The Digimon If you see as I mean, it cannot be joggers. Basically, it's the same uh, Digimon type. Hmm. If you want to joggers, the Digimon, the active Digimon, example, the active Digimon is virus Digimon. It only can joggers with vaccine, data, and free type. It cannot mm, joggers with virus and virus. No, it cannot. Uh, joggers with the same type Yes So it's like the, the joggers is mean it's a curve 
and it's combine or sacrifice your Digimon in the backup to to evolve your main Digimon inactive. Then the condition to evolve this way, both both Digimon in the active and the backup must have the same generation. Example, the active Digimon must be uh, is the champion, champion Digimon. Then the backup one also need to be a champion Digimon. Hammer, hammer. That's how to trigger Joker's evolution. You need to have same generation together, and uh, both both uh, Digimon is not the same type. Mm -hmm. It's not the same type. Then you can trigger the Joker's. Yes. So, yay! All right. Thank you for watching and.